The key to a good night's sleep might be finding out what your sleep animal is. That's right. If you know your sleep animal, you can sleep better, you can eat better, be healthy. We have a sleep coach with us who's going to tell us all about it, Kelly Murray. Hi. Hey, Hello. Kelly. What is this all about? <laughs> so your sleep animal is your natural rhythm of your sleep and awake patterns. We used to think that it was really simple. They were either early birds or night oh. owls. Now yeah. we know that there's right. four distinct sleep animals. We have the lions, the bears, the wolves, and the dolphins. Okay, very oh, good. Okay, so the, tell me about a wolf. Yeah. Yeah, so the wolves, those are our night owls that are really creative. They stay up late working on projects and sleep in. Howling at that moon, right? Yeah, exactly. What can we do to improve their lives and sleep habits? Yeah, so one thing that's hard about being a wolf is that you don't have a lot of energy in the morning. So if you need to get up for work, what I recommend doing is going outside and doing something active. The sun and the activity will increase your energy and cortisol levels. Wow, interesting. Okay. Okay. So what about a dolphin? A dolphin, so dolphins are our classic insomniacs. So they have such a very busy brain. They're highly intelligent. They can't shut that brain off at night to sleep. Okay, so what issues might a dolphin encounter? Yeah, so since dolphins are sleep deprived, they tend to snack a lot. Instead of snacking, what I recommend that they do is go outside for a little boost of sunshine okay. and eat meals that are high in protein to sustain their blood sugar. Very interesting, all of this. And what about a lion, the king of the jungle, right? Yeah, so in charge. <laughs> king of our, the jungle, they are the bosses, the leaders. They're, they go to bed early, wake up early. They do more before eight o'clock than most of us do the, the entire day. Okay, not us, right? <laughs> yeah, not us. I used to be a lion, though. I yeah. was on a lion schedule. And what can a lion do? What can they eat? How do they change things up? Yeah, so themselves? lions are usually healthy when it comes to their eating patterns. The problem with lions is they can't stay awake to socialize. Uh, so what yeah. I, re I recommend that they do is stay away from carbohydrates at dinner because carbs turn into melatonin, the right. sleepy hormone. That's not good. <gasps> All right, what's our yeah. last one, the bear? Yeah, so the bears, that's 50% of the population. They typically rise with the sun and they fall asleep a couple hours after sunset. They're very social and they have high sleep needs. And right. they invented the nine to five, right? I mean, that's what it's built around the bear. Exactly. Any issue they might encounter? Yeah, so bears typically get the 3 p.m. slump where they want to grab for a sugary cappuccino and that's going to pack on the pounds. So instead of that, what I recommend doing is just take a break. Take a nap, do some meditation, yeah. some deep breathing, or walk around the block. That's going to restore your energy better than a sugary latte. Yeah. Okay, wow. Yeah. I don't even know what. I'm a little yeah. lion, I'm a little bear, a little wolf. Uh, can you yeah. switch throughout your life, like one time, yeah. you know, or is this true? Yes, yes, you can switch throughout your life but you really can't change your chronotype. Okay. Yeah. You well, can't fight mother nature. You actually have a quiz that we're gonna share so you can find out which animal you are, and that's gonna be on our website, NBCChicagoToday.com.